honey, are you okay? It's so beautiful. What? Come on, let's let's get you up. Come here, have some smart water. What did they do to you? Anything else? What's what's left? Oh my God, Jen Aniston, I have been in love with you forever. Oh. Sorry, apparently that's worth about a hundred thousand hits. Not for me. God, is it is it hot in here? I'm fired. Well, in closing, I would like to say that smart water is the purest tasting water there is. What are we going to call this video? Jen Aniston's sex tape? I love it. So this became an overnight sensation, and no money was spent on promoting it. The way it was seeded, as we call it, was just to put it on YouTube, and they called it Jennifer and his sex tape. And it worked because everybody in celebrity business, they have a sex tape, right? Except her. Now she got one too. So there were already millions of men and probably women as well searching for Jennifer Aniston's sex tape. And now they found it. So just amazing, amazing insight uh, to create this. So I have another question for you. It's not a trick question. And that is, give it a, give it a, a, a few seconds thought, and then I'll ask you to, to raise your hand, depending on uh, what you believe in. So how do most people make buying decisions? Who think they make buying decisions with logic? <laughs> Who thinks it's with emotions? Oh, yeah! Yeah! Is that a camera? Yeah! <laughs> I am serious. I have asked this question more than a hundred times in front of tens and thousands of people, and I have never experienced anywhere in the world, that includes the U.S., where every single person got it right. I'm going to put that on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, YouTube, etc., etc., etc. Believe you me. No, seriously, that is very, you guys have a, an extraordinary future ahead of you. Seriously, I wish I was kidding and trying to make you feel good, but I'm not. It really is true that very often 50% say one and 50 the other. And then when I say that we solve this with emotion, then somebody wants to fight them. So they can't do. They, they want to rationalize this, right? But it is true. And for that reason, to connect emotionally with someone and to be able to convince them eventually, we have to know the life of a consumer. So that type of insight is very useful. That's something you have to spend time on and be prepared to change every once in a while because consumer preferences, journeys also change, right? And it depends a lot even between gender. If you look at shopping, right? There's a huge difference between how men and women shop. But in some categories, men are very different and much more intense, almost like a female shop, like really intense, like 17 shops in a day. So, so you have to study it. I can't tell you what the results are, but you will find out uh, on your own. The thing about the foundational boxes, I, I like to, when, especially when we talk digital, to divide it into four boxes. One is strategy. Many businesses are very bad at that. They ignore the basics, right? The basics are also part of the mechanics. Because everything we do today involves technology, right? And whenever technology in it is involved, things get more difficult. And there are more details involved. If we want to be successful, we have to 